Hello, this is Brian Resney bringing you an important update about the economy and the investment markets. Well, that correction we saw just a few weeks back is over half uh, recouped actually from the gains in the last few weeks. We're obviously seeing a little bit of resurgence back in the equity markets. The bond market and bond related interest rate sensitive investments continue to go down. And I warned about this all through last year and as we again approached uh, 2018, interest rates are moving up slowly because the economy's getting better. The Fed's gonna raise rates. Investments like real estate investment trusts are gonna do very lousy in a rising interest rate environment. Utilities are gonna do lousy. Long and intermediate term bonds are gonna do lousy. These are investments my firm is avoiding because they're not the right areas to be in. I will tell you as a client of our firm, we do a lot of work daily, research about the economy, the investment markets, where to be and where not to be. And I will tell you, as we see this economy getting just slightly stronger going into the uh, first quarter here of 2018, I anticipate further strength as tax cuts and bigger paychecks hit the consumer. These are all net positives. The equity market, remember, is gonna have volatility. But what's interesting is nobody ever really talks about the volatility of interest rate sensitive investments, especially in bonds. We have had a number of new clients so far this year. And I could tell you that those investors, I'm, I'm sure are extremely happy they hired our firm because the majority came from Wall Street type firms, banks, and or annuity salespeople. And their big concern when they hired my firm was simple. Brian, you've talked about investments that are not appropriate. Yet I find these in our portfolio with the past uh, firm that we were with. And I, we brought that up to that firm, but they never did anything about it. The reason is, folks, is most firms spread the money out all over. Lots of different asset categories all the time. Good ones get dragged by, uh, down by weak ones. Inappropriate investments are always in the portfolio. We don't think that's correct. I firmly believe over the next three to five years, the economy will be better than a 3% annual GDP growth uh, projection. If that happens, rates will slowly move up. Bond investors are gonna get hurt really, really bad. The problem is a lot of investors wait two, three, four years of losses until they finally do something about it because a lot of people think it'll just bounce back. Yes, some assets will come back, but others like bonds as rates go up. And I firmly believe the 10 year, which is around 3% right now, will probably be in the 5% range within three to five years from now. That means probably close to a 20 to 40% drop for most investors who own bonds that are 10 year maturity or higher. Those are some pretty big drops. Those are drops that we've seen in the equity markets from past recessions. But the problem is, again, investors won't do anything about it. I'm glad to say at our firm, we're an active money manager. We are not in long-term bonds or intermediate term bonds. We have short-term duration, floating rate securities, and currently local debt in the emerging market bonds, which actually are doing quite well. We will make adjustments when we see necessary, but again, Things will change over time. We continue to monitor the economy and the growth of our economy and economies around the world, and we'll make adjustments as necessary. Remember, volatility is here. It's always been here. We haven't seen a lot of it last year or really the year before. So plan on more volatility this year and in the future, but that gives you a great opportunity to have the opportunity, again, to make better returns on your money. If you're a client of our firm and you have any questions, please call us, schedule a review appointment so that we can address any of your concerns. And of course, we always appreciate your business and your referrals. Remember, you've got a lot of friends out there. A lot of them are not happy with what they're doing with their money. Chat with them. We love your referral business always, and we really would like to help your friends, families, or business acquaintances. Have a safe and profitable day.